for all my ways before thee. So here we are. You can say each of us is myself, ourself, oneself. All my ways of living, all my ways before thee. All my ways before the Lord. Now, it's something to think, like everything between us and our world is be be between us and the Lord. And sometimes we may, may, we may hide certain things, but the Lord knows, knows our hearts and our reins of our minds. So that really nothing is hidden. So might as well, we might as well be conscious of all our ways of living before the Lord. So as we do that, as we, as we put consciously all our ways before the Lord, you can say those animating tones that are animating all the universe, those tones that Handel perceived in his heart and, and created, it allowed for patterns out of the East. You can say we're in place to allow for those, those patterns that are coming, looking to come through us, to extend through us. So that surely, as Pamela Gray mentioned a little while back, how surely grace and mercy shall follow us. Surely grace and mercy shall follow us as we hear those. And it allows us to experience knowing the tree of life. So we stop eating of the forbidden tree and we're just in place experiencing the moment, the tree of life, experiencing that. When that happens, we present ourselves as a gift of our living to the Lord. And you can say in Christmas time, we look to find the, the perfect gift or the fitting gift for our friends. But what about giving our lives to the Lord? And we may have recognized that, but actually give our lives to be conscious of all our ways before the Lord. And as we do, there's a connection in heart. And we, again, our clarity in mind may come, but, but there's a feeling of heart. We affirm that, of giving our lives as a gift to the Lord. So there's a sense of joy, hearing the joy to the world, actually coming from out of the East into our hearts so we can extend that repeat, repeat the sounding joy, repeat, repeat the sounding joy. And ultimately, that they might have my joy fulfilled in themselves. That they might have my joy fulfilled in themselves. And when that happens, hallelujah, hallelujah.